Well, hello and welcome to our Sum It Up Devos. And we're going to continue in experiencing God through the book of Psalms. And today, we're going to be looking at Psalms 46. Now, this is a pretty major passage that we have. And oftentimes quoted often as we see 46.10. And it says this, Be still and know that I am God. But oftentimes we miss everything surrounding it. And it's an incredible thing that the sons of Korah recorded. So I'm going to read a little bit to you really quickly. Psalms 46 1 says, God is our refuge and strength, always ready to help in times of trouble. So we will not fear when earthquakes come and the mountains crumble into the sea. Let the oceans roar and foam. Let the mountains tremble as the water surge. A river brings joy to the city of God the sacred home of the Most High. God dwells in that city, and it cannot be destroyed. From every break of day, God will protect it. The nations are in chaos, and their kingdoms crumble. God's voice thunders, and the earth melts. The Lord of Heaven's armies is here among us, and the Lord God of Israel is our fortress. Come see the glorious works of the Lord, See how he brings destruction upon the world. He causes wars to end throughout the earth. He breaks the bow and snaps the spear. He burns the shields with fire. And here it is, Psalms 46.10. Be still and know that I am God. I just want to take a moment and stop and point out some major events as we look into Psalms 46 as itself. It talks about natural disasters. So we'll not fear when earthquakes come or mountains crumble into the sea. They're at a place and they're trying to explain, even in the biggest moments where everything is falling apart. They even talk about kingdoms. Maybe you're at a place where you feel like your kingdom is falling apart and you don't know what to do. We look at Psalms 46, and in the beginning, what do they say? It says, God is our refuge. And at the end, what does it say? Be still and know that I am God. You see, it's very, very important that throughout this whole entire passage, the main thing, the main point is this. You can find peace in the midst of chaos with God himself. I know I'm not alone in saying there have been moments in life where I feel like everything is falling apart. Maybe I didn't meet to somebody's standards like my, my wife was hoping me to vacuum every single corner and use the hose for it too, and I just didn't do it. Or maybe it's a collection of a bunch of things and you feel like, I just don't even know what to do anymore. But the thing is, we need to be reminded, is God is our refuge in all times because when we find refuge during those times we will find clarity on what really matters and what god desires for us in this time he's king he's lord but he knows in times of chaos we need to be able to find refuge and we can find it in him i hope today has been as good for you as it has for me and i can't wait to see you on the next one